Hi, this is Ian from Burbigon. Today I'd like to talk to you about the difference between bat bugs and bed bugs and why that's important to us as a business. So a couple of key things we need to know. Uh, where are the, the bed bugs coming from? If they're around the bed, then invariably they're going to be bed bugs. Now, if we're seeing them coming out of walls, we're seeing them coming out from underneath windows, then there's a good chance that's going to be a bat bug. And this is important because the treatments are going to be different. So once we've identified them, and the easiest way i found of identifying them is to get them underneath a microscope, underneath a lens, and take a look at the eye. There's some hairs behind the eye, and if the hairs are longer than the eye, it's going to be a bat bug. If the hairs are shorter, it's going to be a bed bug. So we can easily identify the differences. Now, once we've identified that that is a bat bug, then we need to take care of the colonies. So if there's pigeon nests outside, there's a few things we can do. We can go out there, we can clean the nests up, we can use a, a disinfectant, we use our, our chemicals and we treat those areas, kill off those bat bugs. We're gonna then need to exclude them to stop the reoccurrence of that infestation. So use something like netting or slope that's gonna exclude those birds from coming into that area. Now, once we've done that, we can also investigate and make sure there's no other bat colonies there because if there's bat colonies, we do need to do take care of those as well. So if you have any questions, on bat bugs or bed bugs, please give us a call. If you have any questions about this tip or need additional assistance, please call our office at 1 800 392 6915 or visit birdbegone.com.